artificial so and a lecturer, uh, architectural designer, also a researcher at the Faculty of uh, Architectural University. It depends on the, the type of, the cultural factor of that particular food. Particular is actually relating to the taste. For example, if they so-called uh, French food, so I probably would familiarize myself with the French taste, uh, similarly with the Thai food, so I know which one is a good Thai taste, which one is a bad Thai, Thai bad taste. Sim or with the Italian or Indian, it's also the same. So I'm looking for the quality of all the taste that I'm familiar with in uh, a range of a variety of food. It means the city that uh, adapt itself or be able to adapt itself to the water situation. I think the local, particularly, uh, will it will participate with that uh, most of the time. However, they need they they need the guideline from the government or from the authority on how they should adapt. But on the other hand, I think it's a reciprocal process that the government or the authority is supposed to learn from the local, and the local is supposed to to learn from the government. They they need to work both ways, not not one and the other. I just recently went into a small, not not a small, a linear settlement along the canal in, in on the other side of Bangkok, and in fact I found that uh, the local people they ad adapt themselves, and in order to do that they re they create uh, buildings or architecture that can be adapt adapted to the water situation. So in that sense, so the city can also learn from that kind of uh, adapt adaptability. And uh, to some scale, I think it might be worthwhile. And it might be more economy than to do something uh, with such a high-scale project and uh, use a lot of uh, budget and have, have probably have more negative impact on the other people on rather than uh, everyone can sort of uh, live, live, live together within a city or together the kind of. But then again, uh, when I speak of adapti adaptability, I'm not really convincing with a big scale project development, for example, to really build a big dam or really build a big uh, uh, a father, founder, or die for whatsoever. No one. I think that is a waste of uh, resource. And I think, uh, as a person or as a human being, we it should be better to find another way to adapt to the natural situation than what we have already done. At the moment, I I just have some uh, uh, a big idea and a research proposal. A big idea is uh, coming. It's an outcome from the trip into the the settlement within the clone. That's how they adapt themselves, uh, and uh, how can we learn from that? Uh, so I think in terms of uh, contribute to them, not really, but to learn from them, this might be a good start. Um, the other thing is that in terms of the research, uh, I uh, uh, submit a proposal to study the whole of the special networks in Bangkok, uh, which, which I mean is that the, the street network, the expressway network, the BTS, uh, the train line network, and also the canal network how all these together can uh, sort of uh, build into one big model to see accessibility of logistics within the, the city of Bangkok. Uh, I think that it is very important that we need to learn the, the other way that how we should move within the city and how can we can how we can find the other way around to try to build our 
our city or our life for, for the future. Which means uh, I, I got this kind of idea when uh, actually part of that is to, in, I got it from my personal research and the other part of that I got it from a problem which actually occurred during the big flood in Bangkok. And uh, I had I had to work with uh, some kind of uh, a group of volunteers to try to tell the people that uh, if there is a water level coming up or if the flood is coming really quickly, which way or which route they should take uh, out from the home, and it's going to be a safe route uh, from the home to the other safe place. So I think uh, that kind of uh, uh, I don't know, manual or that kind of uh, knowledge might be uh, a very good idea for a city like Bangkok that we have to adapt ourselves to a situation regarding the water situation.